Hello and welcome back to another Thanos vs. the Ages. Now, in the last episode we had some firepower. In this one, however, we're taking a bit of a step back. As you can see, it's a bit more of a fantasy setting. We've got our peoples of Middle-earth. The folk of the Third Age. We've got Gondor heavies, we've got elves with shields, we've got dwarven matoks, we've got... Elven archers, more elves with no shields this time, but they're, whoop, hang on, wait, camera, wow, they are like, no, they're not on top of each other, okay, <clears throat> we've got the ones with just the swords, and then we got some Rohan infantry, who I just noticed have no feet, that must be awkward for you, and yeah, of course, our elven archers here in the back, we have 10,000 troops, because I figured that's a slightly nicer number to fight with, and we still have our 10 Thanos, because if we only had one Thanos, that would make the episode last a good couple of hours. <clears throat> but, okay, here we have Thanos versus the Third Age. Three, two, one, go. <clears throat> and here we go, Thanos goes sprinting off as usual, ready to get stuck in. And already the first units are flying. Who didn't see that one coming? Look at that. As if it just raining wasn't bad enough. <sighs> Here we go. That must be bad being at the back, right? Because you've got your buddies raining down on you. Surely that would cause another killer, too. Yeah, look at that. Those elves just getting stuck straight in there. Absolutely no problem with getting into the middle. Of course, those arrows are flying in. Now, these are elven archers. So these archers should be pretty strong. Now, this is also the first time we're using the modded units against Thanos in this Thanos vs. the Ages. So I could be curious to see if they can manage to get a kill or maybe kill them all, right? Because you know how the, some of the mods are. They are OP. <clears throat> There's the dwarves getting getting hammered now. One of the Gondor infantry, they're getting stuck in. Oh, there's some Rohan troops around here as well. Of course, the Rohan troops. Notorious for their cavalry. Of which they have none here today. <clears throat> but hopefully that's not going to deter them. Not that they surrounded this Thanos, alright. Look at those arrows flying in. Elven archers just taking no break. Oh my god. That should be one of these archers. There's as many bodies flying as there is arrows. Uh, I did add slightly more archers than the rest of them, but... I don't know how much of a difference that's actually going to make. I wonder, if I take control of one and get punted, do I go flying to... Hang on, let me get in here. Come here, Thanos. Oh wow, 80 damage. I wonder if I'll get him to attack him. Damn it. <clears throat> I don't think as far as they all go, these ones don't seem to be all that overpowered. Whee! Yeah. I got punted. Get that. I like the pattern the archers have formed. Well, all hands are stuck in here, but that's what happens when you have no feet. I guess. Didn't notice that no feet thing before. The ones in the middle are relatively untouched by the archers, but it's like the Hemi's being focused down. I wonder, can we just have a quick peek? Actually, they are doing a decent bit of damage. <clears throat> Could be very interesting. I don't want to grab an archer and run around the side and try and shoot one. La, 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 la. I don't take a bit more of a direct. Having a bit more of a direct effect on this battle, but. Come on. Now, the question is can I actually hit Thanos? Because where is he? <laughs> Damn it, Thanos! I just want to know how much damage the archers do. Never mind them. Yeah, wow. They 
arrows at their feet. Hurt me through 4,000 of them so far. And we look see. Eh, doesn't take that much damage. Definitely need the ranged units, right? Because those gunners did a lot of damage in that last one. Just having those millies just doesn't do that much to them. Well, not these ones, anyway. I'm curious to see what other modded units we could throw at them. Oh man, I completely forgot about them. What about the mummies? We could have Thanos versus the undead. Thanos really versus the ages, but I guess... I guess that kind of fly, right? The mummies were typically pretty strong. Maybe they could kill one. Just come up to about halfway through. Going into war flam. Arrows are flying out so freaking quickly. Holy groups of form. That Thanos has almost broken through and gotten to the archers. I wonder if he'll actually go down that way. I don't think any of the archers are actually getting attacked yet. No. These Thanos are split up into a couple of small groups and singles and. They are just beating away at them. Two of them fighting away against the dwarves. Actually, come to think of it, now we've got this many... This many units for... The Lord of the Rings. Maybe. Maybe it would be possible to do a... Battle of the Five Armies movie, UEBS version, an actual one with the actual units. Of course, maybe I'd need the PC first to actually get the numbers right. There was a good few tens of thousands in that one. And right now, we can just barely hold ten thousand. Something for the future. 3,200 left. Their forces are getting pretty thinned out now. They are doing a decent bit of damage though, I mean, compared to how some of the previous ones have done. Let's see what else at the front here. You get quite a bit. No, not really. They are doing work, it's just. Not enough. So, but, you know, I want to bank this up. How slow can we go? I love the, just the gradual progression of the slowing down. Look at that. Wee! <laughs> oh, that looks awkward. And yet fun! And you've still got no feet. Okay, that looked pretty cool. I mean, yeah. I don't think I've ever actually slowed it down this much. I believe I can fly. I believe we're gonna come down eventually. And you're not gonna like it. Here we go. And... No, that one missed too. However... Friendly fire? Ooh, there's one. No. Yeah, that one hit. Alright. <laughs> Messing with the slow mo. It's good fun. <clears throat> 
just a couple of little pockets left, and then we're onto the archers, which have actually spread themselves around nicely. Oh man, look at this. There are so many arrows flying over his head. <clears throat> it's just a stream of them. It's like an automatic cannon of arrows. Just 2,000 units left. Here we go, they get a few more hits in on them now. See a lot more of these arrows connecting. They're just coming in from all sides. They're coming in from the back, they're coming in from the left. Probably gonna have them coming in from the right. It's just an absolute barrage. However, our archers, are they gonna hit yet? Yes, they are. The archers have been engaged. Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I'm losing count here. I'm seeing multiples disappear into them. I just went to both of them. They're both pretty strong still. As they just work their way up this entire side. Although they did forget about these ones. few more melee troops out here still, but there's a good few of the Thanos engaged on their range now, so it's only a matter of time. Curious to see what their health's like at the end of this. And now they're really taking some damage. <clears throat> Look at all the arrows in the crowd. So many being fired. Look at that litter. There's still a few soldiers trapped in between all the archers here. I don't think I'll be able to do much though. These guys have just walked their way along this entire edge. Well, the bulk of them are just taking out what's left. There is actually still melee troops left. A couple of Rohan, a couple of Gondor. However, not anymore. Bye bye. That's it. It just leaves the archers and a few that's trapped in between them. Time to clean up. Less than a hundred remaining. I wonder how many of them are still in the air. There we go, it's just the last few stragglers. And it is done. They are all in the air, and it is. No, there's one left. <gasps> one survivor run! Too late. <laughs> there we go. 10 Thanos versus 10,000 of the third age. And Thanos wins. There we go. 144,000, 137,000, 150,000. They also did about a quarter of their HP. Ooh, wow. He was close to dying. Damn. Okay, so they were making progress there. 140. I was sort of thinking, yeah, okay, maybe they got about a quarter of them all down, but. Nope. It's a bit hard to do, but yeah, it looks like he was the lowest at 80,000. Damn.
Damn. All right. <clears throat> you took a beating there, didn't you? Not big guy. But there we go. That is the end of this Thanos versus the Ages. Thank you very much for joining me. I don't know if this was technically an age, but it is, it is the third age of the Lord of the Rings universe, so there we go. But yeah, if you like the content, guys, hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate it a lot. Drop a comment down below, let me know what you guys thought, and yeah, I will see you all again next time. For some more Thanos vs. the Ages. Bye.